Pisces. This is your reading for this upcoming week. This reading is for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. Pisces. What's going on with you guys? What's going on with my Pisces? with Pisces. Hmm. What is the energy around Pisces? Please show me the energy around Pisces. The energy around Pisces. Okay. King of Cups. Feeling happy about something. Feeling control of your emotions though I feel. This card came out and spun around. I feel like there's a new beginning for you guys. You guys are interested in something and you feel confident about that. Taurus, Libra, Aries energy there. Some of you guys have like this strut in your step, I feel. Okay. I feel like this has come because you have left something behind that's no longer serving you. Something that was like depleting you emotionally. Three of Cups in reverse. Which is a two of cups, essentially. About a love connection. Some of you guys are starting over from, from someone here. Somebody that you poured a lot of emotions into. I feel like there's a new relationship on the table for some of you here. And you're feeling pretty good about it. Feeling in control. What is crossing my Pisces? Queen of Wands. All right now. So I feel like there's something definitely here as far as a love connection goes. Something that you feel confident about. Um, you feel like this could be a great start for you. You know that you hold the key. But I feel like there's there's something that you need to do. You need to take action on something. You need to show that flirty side. You need to show that you can be um, take charge. Okay? There's something here that, yeah, you got this person. You have their attention. But there's something that's saying, let's do something that we've not done before. Let's do that. Something that you may not have been necessarily comfortable with before. That fiery energy there. Cars are flying out here. And then we have the Page of Cups in reverse. You guys are good for being an emotional um, support system for people. I think this is, is, is for you to dial it back something, some. That is like, um, if, you've been, if you've been telling this person, you know, just spilling your guts about how you feel, um, showing them too much, is for you to be, to dial it back a little bit. Sometimes less is more, is what I'm getting here. Sometimes less is more, guys, okay? What is the underlying issue here for Pisces? Eight of Swords. There's a lot of business that um, you have had in the past with someone. A lot of things that have transpired. A lot of situations that have affected you. And I feel like you're still kind of holding on to that old ways. Old ways of doing things even. Okay. Not letting go of something from the past. It has you um, kind of chained in a certain way of being. Something that you're used to doing. You're used to functioning in, in like the old ways. Whatever that means for you. Okay. That Gemini energy there. What was going on in the recent past for Pisces? Recent past, for, okay, that one wanted to stay out. King of Wands. There's somebody here that is vibing with you so 
that it is not even funny but this person also has some things that are still with them from their past this could be somebody you already know it could be a past with you okay and if this is somebody you already know and you have a history with this person now is the time for you to do something different don't show them all of your cards okay it's what I'm hearing here don't put everything out there for them but they are definitely attracted to you they definitely want to be with you they definitely want to do things with you for sure crowning thoughts for Pisces okay two cards wanted to stay out here you ready to make it happen and I feel like you know that you hold the key whatever happens is up to you you're driving this ship you're driving this ship and you know it definite Gemini energy here it's like this um oh very alluring I'm feeling very cat and mouse kind of um, thing going on with you guys feeling playful feeling coy you know what's coming in for Pisces death transformation change mm-hmm this is you transforming from the person that you were into the person that you are now and the person that you are becoming Scorpio energy how does Pisces view this situation will of fortune is about damn time you're ready to see some change you're ready for things to be different that Sagittarius Piscean energy let's do this shit okay then I have a card that flew out on the floor face down dun, 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 dun. what is this oh, okay all right now three of swords in reverse three of swords in reverse there's still that thought that yeah you know I've been hurt but this too shall pass I'm getting over that I'm tired of feeling in that stuck disappointed hurt state I'm ready for a change to ensue that Libra energy what is the influence here for Pisces influence for Pisces that was sticking out to me that tower energy Scorpio energy that being shook up my whole world is crumbling down around me type of energy okay you know what it feels like to be to be traumatized to be um, knocked off your damn feet by her you know what that is and that is what is influencing you that's what's influencing this change like I need to do something different okay that didn't work for me before putting my heart out there wearing my heart on my sleeve giving all of my emotions to someone and them guzzling up my emotions like a freaking vampire that's what's influencing you hmm. hopes or fears for Pisces strength oh yeah you feel like I know I need to do something different but the one thing that I'm sure about is that I need to be strong enough to do what's best for me the power is in my hands the way that this situation goes is on me and I feel like you guys know that you know that that's that Leo energy having that courage having that pride and standing strong in your own shoes okay 
not allowing yourselves to be fully influenced by your love for someone else or your emotions for someone else, but also seeing the logic and the reason in the situation. And maneuvering as such. Okay. What is the outcome here for Pisces? Look at that. The world. Oh, yeah. You're ready to start over. You're ready to start over. There's a lot that you have learned. There's a lot that you have had to unpack with the past not only with other people's behavior but with your own behavior I feel I feel like you're ready to start over you're ready to turn over a new leaf and um, get this shit on track okay that fixed energy this is Saturn this is karma at play here so I feel like this shit is shifting in your favor things are really starting to look up for you this is what you deserve. This is long term here. Saturn brings long term changes. And it has taken a long, hard journey to get here. But I feel like you are here, my friends. Okay. That is Scorpio, Aquarius, Taurus, Leo energy there. All right, guys. So that is what I have for you. And I'll be speaking with you guys soon.